die, you son of a bitch. Oh, hey there. Okay, Marigold Station, here we come. Yeah, I'm a badass. Hey, it kind of looks like... Um... Someone... I don't know, I was... Kind of... I don't know. I hear scuttling. Hey. Where you be? There you are, you son of a bitch. Alright. Anything over here? Nope. Alright, let's head inside. Did that thing uh, save? It didn't auto save like I wanted it to. Oh, son of a bitch. New save. <coughs> I also have some gummy, gummy worms. My game's gonna freeze. It's gonna be amazing. Let's try this again. <coughs> God damn. Alright, ladies and gentlemen. We are going to what are we who are we looking for? That doctor or whatever? Um I do one thing I do like with um New Vegas fast save. Oh, there it is. Now it's saving. Yay! <laughs> All right, let's see. What I, want. I just want to see the mechanic. Okay, sweet. It just has a new save. That's badass. I like that a lot. Um, the mechanic. Uh, the aim down sights. Aim down sights. I know there's a mod to add uh, aim down sights in this game, but I, I don't like how it, it just, damn it. I don't like um, uh, the, some of the guns don't work right, especially some of the custom weapons that are in this mo in the mod that I have, like this one, it wouldn't work at all. So that's one reason why I did not put that mod on. Oh! 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 Run away! Jesus Christ! I was not expecting that at all. Diazepan. That sounds familiar. Diazepan. Where's the... Do I have the quest selected? I do. Investigate and remove the source. Don't know how I'm gonna do that. I'm probably going the wrong way or something. <coughs> Ow! <coughs> Weakest throw ever. Hey there. Oh god. Teleporting some bitch. 
Grady's last recording. Let's listen to it or read it. Or, if you're uh, listening to this tape, then my brains are splattered all over a wall somewhere, and you've got a job to do. You need to retrieve the package and get it safely to Ronald Lauren and Gurdershade. Tell them Grady sent you. To get the package, you'll need the key. I've stashed it inside an old fire hose case in some maintenance closet in Marigold Metro Station. The key will unlock the safe that contains the package. Look for the room marked by a spinning light. You can't miss it. Good luck. And hopefully, they won't find you too. Huh. Whoa, I'm sorry, Grady. Here, let me... There. That should, yeah, you, you look very comfortable now. Lunchbox. Here's your lunchbox. Alright, so we have another thing to do. That's cool. Uh, wait a minute. I just went in a circle. That's where I came in at. So... Um... Okay. So westbound to Falls Church, this pro Okay, we want to go... We came from that way. Let's go this way. Uh, okay. No, not that. <laughs> Definitely not that. <coughs> that, that way. <coughs> uh, let's head back this way. Is that an ant? Did absolutely no damage. To I do more damage with this gun than I do now than I do with my sniper rifle. Oh, there you are. I heard you, you son of a bitch. Ooh. New Coca Cola. Hell yeah, ammo. Can never get enough ammo. Ooh, a Magnum. Sorry, buddy. Here. Ugh, you're one heavy motherfucker. All right. Uh, we came from down. No, we didn't. All right. I don't know where I'm going. Let's head up here. Probably eat some food to get some health back. Uh, I'm gonna do that. safe key. I don't want to take that. I don't want to take that. Cherry bomb. Cherry bomb. Psycho. Stim pack. That's exactly what I need. to go with that. God damn it. It's gonna kill me. Jesus Christ. That heat, that thing just fucked me up. No, I'm fat. Thank you. Bro, 
Run! Jesus Christ. Oh, my, are my legs broken? Ah, there we go. Ow. Where the hell is the doctor at? Doctor, 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 tell me the news. Oh God! Well, you startled me. You startled me, you really son of a bitch. Creep up on people like that. Hey, you're the. <laughs> <laughs> That's no way to talk to a man of science. Yeah. I don't have time for this kind of childish nonsense. I have some very delicate experiments that I must attend to. How about we start the experiment by decorating the wall with... <laughs> you experiments? What do you mean? My experiments are of a complex nature and would take a scientist to explain. Oh wait, I'm a scientist. How marvelous. My foray into reducing the girth of these insectoid creatures is of utmost importance. I intend to generationally reduce their immense stature by way of a pre-birth induced mutagen. Isn't that clever? Oh, I see. You're trying to make them smaller over time by injecting the eggs. My word, you understand perfectly. How marvelous! Are you aware that your new ants breathe fire? Well, this is rather embarrassing, so you'll have to forgive me, but it appears that I've made a slight miscalculation in my mutagen samples. No shit. Instead of lowering the size of the ants, the brood hatched and developed a, a new biomechanism. I call their genetic aberration pyrosis, the ability to emit flame from their bodies. I may be able to correct this error, but I can't get nearby equipment. I'm shocked you didn't attempt this in a controlled environment first. Your knowledge of experimental procedure surprises me. Indeed, I have skipped a step and directly modified an entire brood. Perhaps I was too hasty. I was so certain it would work. To correct this mistake, I'll need to get to my terminal to modify the mutagen. <sighs> what exactly do you need? My portable terminal is set up in the hatchery chamber near the Ant Queen. If I can reach it, I can continue to work on improving the mutagen. Um, why not just kill the queen and be done with it? If I were to do that, months of data would be lost. No, no, the queen must remain completely unharmed. Oh. Your objective would be to eliminate what I call her quintet of nest guardians. Ooh, filthy little abominations. This will stop the fire ants? No, it should all wrap up rather nicely. I've rigged my equipment at my portable terminal to emit what I call an inhibitor pulse. Once I send this pulse, all of the remaining ants will lose their empathic link with the queen and frenzy destroying each other in the process. So, that's all there is to it. What do you say? <sighs> um... Uh, books aren't going to buy me new ammunition. Why can't man follow the ants' example? They work together as a team, every waking moment dedicated to the colony. They require no wealth or material <coughs> items. Everything they need is provided for them by their fellow insects. But I digress. If it's payment you need, all I can offer is one of my mutagenic bio-enhancers. Okay. Mutagen by what? I've managed to isolate some of the fire ant genes and distill them into human safe genetic enhancers. I can inject you with one of these formulas and you'll find yourself with either enhanced strength or enhanced perception. Not only that, but you'll be somewhat more resistant to fire. How marvelous. Marvelous. Okay. Uh, this is a heavy test, uh, Doc. I'm gonna need some serious incentive. Yes, I suppose you're right. Science must learn to acquiesce to your standards in order to advance itself. I was merely going to offer up one of my mutagenic bio-enhancers, but I suppose I could up the ante. 
I will also award you with my old lab coat. It served me well over the years, and you may find it useful for your own experiments. Great. That's exactly what I need. You will? How marvelous! Be careful, my friend. The nest guardians can be quite tenacious. Still in my gun. <sighs> Alright, let's go do this. Much to do, so much to do.